aspect, I'm gonna find something else she took. Police are looking for a woman they say is talking her way into seniors' homes and taking their money. We told you about the woman last week after she stole from a woman in Lee Summit. Now, Warrensburg police say they're looking for her. I'm Dominique Griggs. I'm Pat McGonigal. Now, we're seeing online comments about this same scam happening all throughout the metro. Fox 4's Sheree Honeycutt spoke with two neighbors who say she scammed them. And Sheree joins us with more on who police are looking for. Sheree? Pat and Dome, if someone tells you they're helping a child with cancer, most people will offer prayers, help, and sometimes even money. Two people I spoke with today say this woman used a sob story to distract them and made off with hundreds. Pat Newbauer and Bob Williams are neighbors. They live in a senior neighborhood in Grain Valley. On December 5th, both had an unexpected visitor. She came in and I turned and looked and it wasn't the cleaning lady. And I said, who are you? I said, you're not who I'm expecting. I just motioned for her to come on in, and she did. And she had some little handmade Christmas stuff. Warrensburg police say they believe this woman is Laura Johnson, and she's doing this across the metro. She told both Pat and Bob she was raising money by selling Christmas items for a child with leukemia. And of course, my old heart just pump, pump, pump. And she had three of them with her, and I bought all three of them. And then she wanted to know if she could use my bathroom. Newbauer says she made off with an envelope of around $200 in cash. Williams says he bought this mug and then she distracted him. Yeah, I just laid my billfold down there and I went in and got her an aspirin. She said she had a headache. It wasn't until later they realized they donated more than they expected. I didn't notice the money gone until the next day when I went to get some money out of my wallet. I'd laid my billfold over there and I picked it up and noticed it was real thin and she went through and took everything out of it. My driver's license, my social security and about $200 in money. Both neighbors hope police find her. I pray that she finds a different vocation. I mean, she'd be good, I guess, at fundraising because she's raised a lot of them. Be alert for that kind of stuff and don't don't take for granted that everything's all right and nothing like that's going to happen to me because it will. Now, she's known to drive a silver Pontiac G6. The Warrensburg police say to contact them if you see her and to let el elderly friends and family know about her. Show them her picture just in case she knocks on their door. Sheree Honeycutt, Fox 4 News.